In 1945, as the Second World War was drawing to an end, Mount Ruapehu erupted, building up a thick layer of ash at its summit. Eight years later, on Christmas Eve 1953, the mountain's crater lake broke through its fragile ash walls, sending a flood of mud and debris down the Whangaehu River. When the Laha reached the railway bridge at Tangawai, it swept away a pier on the bridge that had been weakened by a previous Laha in 1925. Oblivious, the Wellington to Auckland Express was heading for the bridge at full speed. The driver saw the Laha and braked, saving the back half of the train, but too late to stop the locomotive and the first carriages from collapsing the damaged bridge and plunging into the river. And I looked out the window and uh, saw, I couldn't believe what I saw, actually, a lighted carriage on its side, floating down the, well, floating down on its side with the lights on and the river, and then they, it suddenly went out. Suddenly, darkness. You know, everyone screaming, what happened, my God? Huh. On Christmas Day, 1953, New Zealand awoke to the news of its worst rail disaster, 151 dead.